What is up everyone and welcome back to more Naruto Shippuden. So I am here with my reaction to episode 459. So this is the first video that I'm recording since I took a week off. So I'm gonna be rusty today. I just know I am. I had such a fantastic week off. And I was debating if I was going to take a second week off and just do like the full thing and then come back in 2021. But I was like, I don't really have anything else to do because they put us into another lockdown. Yay! <laughs> so I'm like, are you kidding me? So yeah, we're back into another three week lockdown and it is what it is, I suppose. So what better thing to do than to just watch a ton of anime, am I right? So the last episode, I actually thought the last episode was only going to be Itachi. I thought it was going to be the end of my Itachi appreciation week. But actually we went back into the main story and what? <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. Like, I just felt so beyond confused. There was like the ultimate betrayal for Madara with Black Zetsu. Sasuke and Naruto are just like, what? What is? Yeah. Yeah. Things are weird right about now. There's only 500 episodes left. So, wait, what? <laughs> There's only 500 episodes in total. Can you imagine if there was 500 episodes left? There's only 500 episodes in total. So what the heck are they going to do in these last 40? Are they going to have another twist? Is there going to be more? Like, I don't know. Don't forget if you want to watch the Patreon style version of this video to head on over to my website suzilu.co.uk and become a VIP member. I've got no wires on me today. Feels good. I got in-ear headphones so I'm excited to see what they sound like because I haven't even tested them yet. So with that being said, let's do this. God, it's like eerily quiet. Am I right? <laughs> It's literally the end of the world. Like everyone's living their best dream world life. But they're literally taking all their chakra. Chakra had been dispersed to those who were unworthy. The seal that caused such deep humiliation has now been shattered. May the infinite moonlight guide you. Use my body. Become one again. And thus, the tale of revival concludes here. It's Chakra. <laughs> We're not gonna be able to stop them! Oh my god! I just, I can't, I can't, you guys. I'm gonna absorb the chakra from the both of you, too. Damn it! That's so horrible! It's like when he's like, Hashirama, where did I go wrong? And there's your final boss, ladies and gents. Oh my god. Kaguya Otsutsuki. Kaguya. I just can't believe all of this. You know that? It's just gone so beyond crazy. This is super loud in my headphones. It sounds really strange listening to this with like brand new headphones. I didn't even recognize like Black Zetsu's voice. I think it was Black Zetsu, right? Oh my gosh. I can just imagine that things are going to get way worse. So I guess that's the end of Madara then? Yeah. That's not how I expected him to go. Not at all. Wow, if Sasuke is even concerned, now I'm concerned. She's gonna recognize that. <gasps> oh, get out the way! Sasuke! 
I hate that Kakashi and Sakura just have to stand there doing nothing. Yeah, that would do me in as well. Look at the legs of her hair! <laughs> Don't make any careless moves right now. No, rather, they are Indra and Ashura. I mean, it's fitting that that would be who would take you down, though, isn't it? It's like passed down through all the generations. Who is she? Why'd Madara suddenly become her? This chakra, it's far greater than Madara's. I can't believe such a person existed. You're just lucky that old Gramps gave you the power that he did, otherwise it really would be game over right about now. Obito. Obito. So, is Obito alive right about now? There's always a possibility when it comes to Naruto, okay? Imagine Obito is the one that saves the world. It's futile to speak to you about that when all you do is tamper with Chakra without knowing its true meaning. This place, this land is my precious nursery. And that means I cannot let it be damaged any further. So let us put an end to all this fighting. Huh? I what? shall erase what? all of you here instead. What the hell? How is this? No, someone grab Obito! Is this a Genjutsu? No. This feels different. How can Summon it be real Jutsu. though? Sasuke, over there! Get him, get him, get him! Naruto can keep, take care of himself. <laughs> or not. <laughs> Kakash Sensei tied one end of a scroll onto his kunai and used it just like a rope. For Obito, he just pinned him to the wall with a kunai. Oh, that's like Jesus, God. <gasps> oh no. <gasps> so how is this possible if this isn't again Jutsu? She summoned an alternate dimension all around us. I mean, she is the final boss after all, but this strength, I'm a bit worried. Our whole world will come to an end if either of us dies in this fight. Only your six paths power of light and my six paths power of shadow can seal away that being in front of us. If we're not able to do that, humankind will be exterminated. The two of us can't afford to die no matter what. Kakashi Sensei and Sakura just happened to be near you when the infinite Tsukuyomi was launched. That's all. You understand, right, Naruto? Are you basically saying that Sakura is useless, Sasuke? I know what you're saying, and that you're right. But still, this is also one of those times when your body just moves on its own. Like on that bridge. You beat him, Sasuke! <gasps> I'll never forget it! Oh, I hate the fact that my Naruto journey is coming to an end. I hate it. Can we just talk about the animation in this episode suddenly? It just looks stunning. I can't believe that even for a split second, I actually thought that Sasuke had died in that episode. And now just thinking back, I'm like, duh. <laughs> Sasuke is right. Back then, maybe Sasuke did act subconsciously. Thank you, Naruto. No, 
I genuinely believe that there was a part in Sasuke's heart that he wanted to save his team. Ah! No! No! My hawk's chakra points were hit. Oh god. Oh god, oh god, oh god! We're going down! I'll have to use Susano. <laughs> no! She's good. She's real good. I don't like this. So yeah, where are we in the grand scheme of things? Are we just not here anymore? We're not in this real world dimension? Is that a thing? <gasps> Madara's rods are disintegrating. Yeah. At last I can move. Now, if I can just get to the spot where I sensed that massive chakra, I might learn something. I love that our Hokage are still with us. I do, I love it. Like, come on guys, save the day. I've got to get to Naruto, just one more time. But how? They're in another dimension. How the heck do you cross dimensions? Especially when Obito's there. When he was enhanced by Six Paths Chakra, Madara levitated too. Shadow Clone Jutsu! I don't like where we are fighting right now. I just, I feel super uncomfortable. Freaking lava! You act triumphant just because you have a special accoutrement. However, no matter what kind it might be, all chakra belongs to me and me alone. <laughs> She really is a psychopath, isn't she? Chakra! Woo! Come on, Naruto! I just can't get over how strong she is! This is so epic! <laughs> I do, I feel like we're at the end of a Final Fantasy boss! Oh no, she's overpowering! Sasuke, no! Come on, Sasuke! Oh yes, yes! She's gonna see it though, isn't she? She looked sad. God, I've got chills, I've got chills! Why does she look so sad? No! Even Susano is useless. So what do we do? Let's get Obito down while we have the chance. Is Obito even alive? Someone tell me! It's just like this foothold. We've both benefited from Six Paths' power. But if we're not able to seal her away, all of it will be meaningless. Yeah. Everything we've ever learned Every power we have, she's just flicking us off like it's nothing. Guys? Guys! Free hugs! Oh my god.
Everything that happened while mother was gone and molded it as well. It means that this was the plan all along. I knew that it was possible, depending on the reincarnate's power, and to receive the power to seal away mother as well. Huh? But we're gonna seal ten tails! Indra and Ashura's reincarnates cooperating this closely is rare. Let me tell you her tale while I absorb all of your chakra. Oh my god, what? <laughs> it was said to have been a most powerful seal. The jutsu that transformed ten tails into a catastrophic planetary devastation core and turned it into the moon. But just before the seal took hold, she gave birth to me, in order that she could one day be restored. I don't have any candy to give you, but the puppet show is about to begin. Wait, when you say that she gave birth to you? Who's your daddy? <laughs> wow, I, I have like quite a few thoughts about that episode right there. So... First of all, I definitely noticed the animation went up tenfold in that just then. So basically, I'm on to the last DVD now, which is a lot smaller than the other ones. But anyway, I'm on to the last DVD now, and I noticed quite heavily the, uh, the difference, the upscale. It was awesome, the animation. Or it could just be that... I haven't watched Naruto in a week and I forgot how awesome it already was, but it felt like it was different. It's crazy to think that after everything we've gone through, that now suddenly we're still being outmatched. And uh, <laughs> it just makes me think that, okay, so we are not strong enough to deal with her. So in some way, we're probably going to end up doing the Naruto talk where he's just going to end up like talking to her and she'll back down because that just tends to be his thing. Because I can't imagine maybe if we can combine our powers like Sasuke and Naruto that we could take her down. But yeah, so you're trying to tell me that this has been in the works since day one. It's kind of crazy when you think about it, that this has been the plan all along. So it's good as well because I remember saying to you guys in a previous episode, I was like, so if she's come back, that means that there was a time when she was sealed away and she was sealed away by her children. So we can obviously do this again with Sasuke and Naruto. Fingers crossed anyway. All right, looks like we got a backstory coming in the next episode, and I'm excited to find out more about this character. Her tears as well. Oh, just, she seems like me, actually. Like a psycho, but a little bit emotional as well. Yeah, I don't much care for her at the moment, but... Uh, I'm sure I will, because that's what Naruto always does. It makes you love all the characters. All right, I hope you enjoyed my reaction to this episode, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Bye.